Now let's move forward and understand geometric mean. Geometric mean is calculated using this formula where we first multiply each of the observations and then take the root of this. That is, we take it to the power of 1 by n, where n is the number of observations. Let's take a small example where we have just two data points, 9 and 4. So to calculate the geometric mean, I simply multiply 9 and 4. Since the number of observations is just 2, so I do 1 by 2 in the power and the geometric mean come geometric mean comes out to be 6 in this case now talking about the mathematical treatment property as we did in case of mean the mathematical treatment property for geometric mean looks something like this where this is your grand this is your grand geometric mean after combining the geometric means of two different data sets so it is n1 times of log of g1 where g1 is the geometric mean of the first data set n2 times log g2 divided by n1 plus n2 which is the total number of observations. Also geometric mean is also affected both by change of scale as well as origin.